welcome to Spirit's Night Silence. My name is Jasmine Ellis. My investigation brings me to Split Rock Quarry on the Mendip Hills. This is the entrance where the lorries will come down, turn. Here to the left. is the fiery forge. That part there is actually was used for the crusher, the crushing machine for the stone, which um, split rock quarry was dug out so purely for its limestone. And the limestone was mainly used for the Victorian houses that you see nowadays, um, still standing. Those two places there is the fire forge and apparently at night you should be able to hear the machinery sound the sound of the fire the flames and also men talking and laughing as they go about their work we will see <laughs> yeah many people have stated they've heard strange noises coming between the split rock behind them in the woods. They hear women's voices, screams. They've also heard banging noises like a climber is going up the rock face. But I think it's all a bit silly and I will tell you the reason. Why. As you can see, there are campfires dotted all over the place. Now, I've grow up, grew up here. I can remember a time when I used to play hide and seek with my brother, sister, and all our friends up the top there. And I've never known this place to be haunted. But this is the reason why I am here. It is more speculation than actually research that people has heard different noises in the night. Now I'm saying this because the simple reason is quite a lot of people around campfires that they've just made having a few cans of beer throughout the space of the night getting a bit drunk and then the mind starts playing tricks gets the better of them and therefore start hearing strange noises. So, this is one place, like I said, I grew up. I can remember playing here. I used to sit up, up behind the trees up there. I used to sit and stare down people walking past, walking their dogs on a Sunday afternoon. So, it'd be interesting to see if what the youngsters who have said about this place is true or not. I'm here purely because of speculation. I'm hoping, yes, my camera will pick up something, but really much speaking, I am not going to hold my breath now. Like everywhere else, woodlands, old abandoned quarry, you are going to get some kind of mist and you're going to get cold spots, which I know. And maybe occasionally you might hear a stone falling. But I am hoping that my camera my voice recorder will pick up something more than just that. And who knows, with the sound of the crows, this could be a very spooky night indeed. Happy haunting everyone. 